Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. So as promised, I'm going to be sharing with you guys my huge collective Dollar Tree haul. So this is going to be my haul from the last couple of weeks of shopping at Dollar Tree. So um, you guys have come shopping with me a bunch of times and I have found so much good stuff. I am super, super just like impressed with all the stuff Dollar Tree is coming out with. I don't know if they have like someone new on their team that's like coming up with all these really cute trendy things there must be some sort of thing going on over there and i love it i'm so happy so thank you dollar tree for coming out with affordable adorable trendy items and i cannot wait to share with you guys everything i picked up and then to start using all of it so if you guys want to see everything i got at dollar tree then please keep watching and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you have not yet hit the little button down below and then there's a little bell right next to that you can tap so you don't miss out on my future videos i post all about affordable things, affordable beauty, Dollar Tree hauls, Shop With Me's, TJ Maxx, Marshalls, Five Below, all those fun stores. So you guys don't want to miss out on my future content and I'm so excited you guys are here today. So let's go into my collective Dollar Tree haul. Before I get into it, I want to say if you guys are interested in the makeup I'm wearing, I am going to be uploading a lot of makeup tutorials I already have been on my Instagram. It's at Kim Nizzolo. That is also linked down below. So if you want to see how I got this eye look, then check out my Instagram. Here are my first couple bags. I have three bags in total. So this first one, I'm like super excited because I totally forgot what I got. So we have two food items here. Dollar Tree has been getting in really great food lately, which is super exciting. Um, they have a lot of nice snacks, vegan snacks. So like this first one is so natural. This is the freeze dried apple slices. And yeah, I mean, the bag is, it's a little small. Uh, literally the only ingredient in here is apples. So it says, um, we harvest the freshest fruits directly from the farm and use, an, use a unique freeze drying process to remove the water from the fruits. Perfect little crunchy snack. So I think what I'm actually gonna do is end up doing a, um, video where I try out the snacks like I did with the all day products so if you guys are interested in that definitely comment down below I'll probably just end up doing it even if no one wants to see it but I think it might be fun because there are so many cool snacks coming out at Dollar Tree so this next one is dairy free low sodium made in the USA and this is what it looks like it's the Sherwood granola bites in chocolate so these are gluten free ruled oats rolled oats um, glucose, sugar, brown rice syrup, brown sugar, uh, crisp rice, salt, cocoa powder, baking soda. So I thought these weren't bad. Um, it is 125 calories for about six little clusters. So how cool is this? Like, I feel like this is something you would see at Target so or your local grocery store. So I was really excited about these two food finds. And um, I'm definitely, I think in the past I was like, oh my gosh, like Dollar Tree food, that's a big no-no. Like you just, you would avoid it at all costs because it just seems a little bit shady. But I feel like now they're getting in really good stuff and I'm not afraid anymore. You guys know what movie that's from. Comment down below. Okay, next. I got some hair items. So I got this adorable snakeskin headband. Like how cute is this? So trendy, snakeskin is still really popular, animal print, um, and it has like a little stretchy band in the back. I'm a headband junkie, you guys already know. I have a whole bin like full of headbands, so I thought this one was adorable. Then I got this scrunchie. I actually feel like I, literally I have this scrunchie that I wear all the time, and I was like, I don't have that many scrunchies, so... I need to up my collection. So I got this little leopard one. I thought it was so cute. I am still on the cheetah print kick. I love it. I know maybe some people are like done with it, but I still think it's really cute. So I wanted to pick this up. I just love wearing scrunchies. I have not worn regular hair ties in such a long time. I even wear scrunchies when I work out, to be honest. Um, but I find they hold up my hair well. So I thought this one was so cute. A couple different animal prints. They had, I think, a zebra one. They had the cheetah one. And the snakeskin and then they also had little scrunchies if you watch my shop with me you can see those that had the little like 
ties that hang down which those are really cute as well I absolutely loved this headband and I couldn't believe that they had like tie-dye items at Dollar Tree because you guys know this is super super trendy right now so this is new and they're getting a new stuff every single week so you have to check back so this has the little knot on top it is so adorable I loved the print it's like a purple and blue and if you saw my shop with me they also had a little scrunchie that matched this so I cannot wait to wear this another headband because this one I just thought was absolutely adorable I'm just gonna take off the little thing that came with it um, this one is like a soft kind of um, what would you call this it kind of feels like a microfiber towel but not velvet um, and I just kind of like the texture of it I love the little knot on top super cute and fun and I loved this purple color this is like one of my favorite purple shades like this kind of I don't it's not periwinkle but like a lilac is what you would call it so I thought this one was so cute and they had um, a blue a pink and like a cream color like these kinds of headbands can just jazz up any outfit like even if you're just wearing like a plain tank top or t-shirt you throw on one of these and I just feel like you look instantly glamorous especially if you have like really pretty curls in your hair a couple of masks so this first one is from April bath and shower which is like the Dollar Tree house brand of spa bath and skincare these are the hand and nail gloves and I just thought these would be fun for maybe like a little Instagram video and moisturizing my hands I know a lot of us could use this right now because we're all using so much hand sanitizer and washing our hands that a little uh, spa day for our hands is much needed um, and then I got this bolero geranium face mask with radish root and I thought the packaging was super pretty they have great face masks or sheet masks so it says this heals damaged skin um, geranium helps moisturize great for sensitive skin it has geranium leaf extract and it has radish root extract and it has aloe as well so I picked up two of these masks I'm um, definitely if you're looking for sheet masks head to Dollar Tree some more hair items I could not resist these because they were so cute I got this adorable pearl hair clip I love these they also had that uh, snap clip one that I've worn many times in my past videos so I did not have this one yet so I picked that one up and then this one was so adorable um, this one doesn't have as strong of a hold as this one so um, if you have thicker hair it might not stay up as well but it's a little gold heart how precious is that so I love anything with hearts on it and I loved the gold so got these two you can see they're really getting adorable hair stuff in like this reminds me of um, a lot of clips you'll see on Amazon some beauty items so one of you guys told me in the comments to pick up this eyelash curler and I got the pink one so I cannot wait to test this out I love curling my lashes every time I put on mascara I always curl my lashes first because I just love getting that little bit of lift I feel like it really opens up your eyes so this is from Sassy and Chic. Then I got this LA Colors Berry Eye Palette. So when you first see this, you're like, that looks so dinky. Like the palette size is insanely small for sure. But I love these palettes. Like the mattes and the shimmers are really, really nice. Shockingly enough. Um, I have the peach one, which I used in an Instagram video. That video I didn't edit yet, but... I was like really blown away by the quality like I put on the shimmer and I was like what like this is crazy so maybe the quality is really good they just made the pan size really small so they would have to use less product so this one's berry they had berry the peach and I think they had a nude so definitely pick these up yeah it's a pain because the pan size is super small but we can make it work because the formula is pretty awesome for a dollar I got this um, beauty benefits lasting blush blush and this is in pink clouds it's just like a really pretty light dolly kind of pink shade I thought I could test this out in one of my Dollar Tree makeup tutorials and then this is a new color quad cream lipstick from beauty benefits and it's just kind of like a mid-tone peachy pink color the shade is called sunny pink and I'm actually noticing this is made by Marquins, which are the same people who make Wet n Wild, um, Black Radiance. So 
That's pretty interesting. I can't believe I didn't notice that till now. Okay, so just so you guys know, when you're buying anything from Beauty Benefits, it's the same people who make Wet n Wild, so it's probably the same ingredients, you guys. Just, that's pretty cool. And then I got this makeup brush cleaning mitt, which I love these. They're also great for travel because I know when I go away, I take makeup brushes with me. But then I'm always like, wait, how am I going to clean them? So I love taking this with me. Um, I do have a pink one like this in my kitchen, so I'll probably keep this one in my bathroom. Um, I can also do like a little demo on this if you guys want to see. But the, it has a little finger slot underneath if you want to put it in your finger and use that to hold it in place. And I thought the color was really cute. So this is great for... Any size brush, you could do face brushes, eye brushes will be perfect on here. Okay, then going into my next bag. These are the bags we have now um, since they got rid of the plastic. They're actually pretty, pretty sturdy. I've had some of these paper bags before and they literally break the second I like go into the parking lot and I have things like falling through. That's why usually I end up taking my own bags, but there we have it. I got a bunch of stuff from this trip. This one, you guys are going to be like, why did you get that? This is actually for a DIY that I'm going to be doing, these two pack of um, clear bowls. I don't know if, maybe I'll post that on my Dollar Tree Instagram. It's at Dollar Tree Dolly, D-O-L-L-I-E. I'm going to do like a little farmhouse DIY with these bowls. A notebook, this is for, um, for me, for my studying. So I actually didn't have like a notebook and I just thought this one was cute because it was neon this is in the school supply section this is also for my diy but these are actually great um if you have a room that doesn't have a light like i have a laundry closet that has no light in it so putting these in there is like perfect if it's nighttime and i'm trying to do laundry they're just like these little push led lamps you do need to put your own um AAA batteries in here, but they sell those at the Dollar Tree as well. Then I got this nautical rope for DIYs. I actually got four of these. This is in the floral section. Um, this is so cute if you like to do um, like nautical or like farmhouse DIYs or wrap it around something and just make it look really kind of like rustic-y. Um, so my Dollar Tree, like every single one has been out of these for months. So that's why I stocked up and got a bunch because I knew they would go quick. Um, so I love, love this nautical rope. This is another item from Beauty Benefits. This is their lip gel. So I got this because it reminded me a lot of the Lancome Juicy Tubes. So again, this is made by the same people. Now we know who make Wet n Wild products. Um, so the shade of this is called Terra and it's kind of like a peachy color. It says it has high shine. So um, I will test this also in my Dollar Tree makeup tutorial if you guys want to see that. They had quite a few different colors. I thought this one would be fun for summer. And as mentioned, I got these Sunbeam AAA batteries. I'm sure they're not as great as like Energizer or Duracell, but for those little lamps, I figured why not? They were right there. Some more craft items. I ended up getting this Crafter Square. I love all the Crafter Square items. This is the Woodworth glue because I'm going to be doing a lot of different projects. And I just thought this would be really good for any sort of wood things that I'm gluing together. So I picked that up. And then this was so fun. It's this chalkboard paint. Um, it says made in the USA. You could also just honestly use this as chalk paint, like black chalk paint. You don't have to put chalk over it if you don't want to. But if you want to make something, say like a chalkboard wall, I think this would be really fun if you have a toddler. Obviously, you would need like a bunch of these, maybe like five of them if you're painting like a little wall. It's still an affordable little project if you were wanting to do that. Um, so I thought this would be neat for, I don't even know, <laughs> I just picked it up because I thought it was cool and I'm sure I could use it on something. I have actually like a craft bin where I keep all my craft stuff. So when I need something from there, I just kind of look through and see what I have. So definitely the crafting section at Dollar Tree is awesome i love their stuff it reminds me a lot of stuff you find at michael's next up i actually got a t-shirt and these are so soft you guys so i got this it's actually a youth youth i got a medium so um i liked the color honestly it's very soft um and i got this because i want to do um a little decal so i have my silhouette machine that i've talked about in the past 
and I can do like iron-on vinyl transfers so I want to do something really cute on here and for a dollar that is really good they don't even have that price at Michael's the t-shirts there I think are like five dollars so you could stock up um, they had quite a few different colors if you watched my last video my shop with me you can see they had like purple they had a light gray so I'm definitely gonna get some more of these whenever I want to do uh, vinyl t-shirts I was so excited about this next find this is actually another hair item so this is from Remington which is a name brand as you guys know so they are actually I don't know if you're able to tell on camera but they are matte like soft touch bobby pins and I remember seeing these at Target and I thought they were so cool I really love the matte look as opposed to like the shiny bobby pin and also it helps hold your hair in place and I always wear bobby pins like specifically on this side of my hair when my hair is down I like to put this side up because it always just ends up bothering me um so they had white ones and they had black ones and I thought this was so cool so I definitely wanted to pick these up and as we all know bobby pins literally disappear into outer space so it's always good to have a pack on hand and these would have been like five bucks if I got them retail price at Target so and my most favorite finds are these Wi-Fi signs with the little chalkboard on the bottom oh my goodness these are so adorable so this one says welcome the Wi-Fi password is and then you have a little chalkboard I actually don't know why they put a hashtag down here because I don't know if anyone's Wi-Fi has a hashtag this reminds me of like a wedding like uh if you had a wedding hashtag I think they got a little confused there but we can just avoid that and pretend that's not there um but it's so fun and you can put your wi-fi password here in chalk i probably would use a chalk pen which they also have like the marker which they also have at dollar tree just so it might be a little bit neater also chalk markers aren't permanent they come off with a magic eraser so it also has a little twine so it fits right into all the decor in my house perfectly and it's so funny because the other night um i was at my in-laws house and everyone's like what's the wi-fi password and i saw these and i was like oh my gosh this would have been like so perfect for that so if you have a lot of guests over your house if you have a guest room then this would be awesome i know every time i go somewhere i'm always like what's the wi-fi password because we all like to go on wi-fi and they had three i got two this is the other one it said wi-fi sweet wi-fi and it actually has like a faux kind of wood look which i thought was cute so I highly recommend getting these. Um, I think it's such like a useful little item and they're so cute. I couldn't decide which one I wanted. So I got both, of course. Like, I just, I don't know. I could always switch them out if I want to. Um, so I love these. And if you guys definitely, uh, if you find these at your store, tag me on Instagram so I can see your finds. I thought that was adorable. Dollar Tree is so cute. Okay, and next, are you guys ready for this? I was so shocked by this fine so i actually found really cute sunglasses i know it's crazy at the dollar tree i never always i always look at their sunglasses hoping i'll find something cute and there never has been anything cute until now i'm telling you guys someone's like in their department stepping up their game like whoever is ordering this stuff you're doing a good job so um i got two pairs so this first one i was like wait is this for real so this first pair actually is like a little dupe for those $450 Celine sunglasses is that not crazy I remember seeing Kim K wear these um theirs have like a little these little like three dots on the side oh, they're literally identical so they're these oversized square frames like how cute can you believe these are from Dollar Tree you would never know like honestly they look super high-end um they're a dollar from Dollar Tree can you handle this they're so cute and also I must say wearing them the sun protection on them is actually really good they are like UV protected they have like a little sticker on the front when I first bought them just so you guys know they actually are really good sunglasses this pair reminded me of like a vintagey kind of style um the only thing I'm noticing is that they're like leopard and it's kind of wearing off on the bottom I don't know why I guess that's what you get for a dollar but anywho they're still cute no matter what and I can always get another pair because they were literally only a dollar but oh my goodness are these not the cutest they're like little retro vintage cat eye glasses I never thought I'd see the day when <laughs> there would be this kind of cute stuff at Dollar Tree so they have the little points 
I just thought they were super fun. You can kind of see, I don't know why that happened, but it kind of, the leopard print like rubbed off a little on the bottom, which things, but for a dollar, you can't beat them. I love that kind of like retro cat eye style. And I'm really hoping that they come out with even more sunglasses because if this is any sign of what's to come, I am really looking forward to it. And I just thought they were so adorable. All right guys, so that is my Dollar Tree haul for this week. I had so much fun sharing all these items with you guys. And there is so much cute stuff, right? Like, do you guys believe all this fun stuff? Um, let me know in the comments down below what your favorite item was. I love hearing your Dollar Tree recommendations. And that is it. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was so much fun to film and I'm having a great time doing my little Dollar Tree filming and hauls. So, love you guys so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!